Hello there, and thank you for tuning on to another episode of our Scripture Breakdown Ministry. My name is David Abraham, and our scripture for today comes from Galatians 2, verse 21. It says, I do not set aside the grace of God, for if righteousness could be gained through the Lord, Christ died for nothing. I repeat, I do not set aside the grace of God, for if righteousness could be gained through the law, Christ died for nothing. So here, I want to divide this scripture into three parts. The first part says, I do not set aside the grace of God. That is, I'm not ignorant of the grace of God. I'm not oblivious of the grace of God. I'm not saying, I'm not aware of the grace of God. That is, the grace of God is present. That is, I accept the grace of God. That is, I'm aware of the grace of God. That is, I'm aware of the application of the grace of God. That is, I'm aware that grace is something we do not deserve and therefore we use it to the, to the max, we use it to the fullest because we are the children of God, because we are the one true God, because we are the one who walk in the grace of God. So for if righteousness could be gained through the law, Christ died for nothing. So for if righteousness could be gained through the law, so that means there is no law in righteousness. Abraham believed God. He was accounted to him unto righteousness. That is in the Old Testament. That is during the Abrahamic era. But now we live in the era of Christ. And he says, if righteousness could be gained through the law, that means righteousness cannot be gained through the law. All following after the precept and the statutes and all the Ten Commandments of God does not earn you righteousness, does not make you a righteous man. Righteousness can be gained by faith. Righteousness can be gained by followership of the fruits of the Spirit. Righteousness brings about justification. Righteousness of faith brings about justification. Righteousness can be gained by faith. Righteousness by, can be gained by our followership of the person of Jesus Christ. Righteousness can be faced by honoring God. Righteousness can be gained by obedience. Righteousness can be gained by following after the instructions of God. Lest Christ died for nothing. So if righteousness could be gained by the law, Christ died for nothing. So right now he's telling us that righteousness cannot be gained by the law. Righteousness can only be gained by our ex exercising of our faith day in day out. By exercising our faith on our movement. By exercising our faith from one point to another. Now I want to pray that God expounds our mind. God expounds our heart. That we'll be able to run with this word and walk with it. That we'll be able to, to give us a deeper understanding of the way God works. All this I ask through Jesus Christ, our Lord. I thank you so much for listening. And God bless, God bless. In Jesus' name, amen.